to come. Greens, greens, and nothing but greens. The new musical is a fantasy that will bring to life a cast of characters drawn from the pages of classic children's fairy tales. Among them, its star, Bernadette Peters, playing an evil witch. Raving me, raving me, my it's a lot of fun. I didn't, I never played a witch before, and it's really, because you can do anything as a witch. She'll, there's no boundaries or limits on what a witch does or what a witch can do or what she might decide to do or whatever. And I laid a little spell on them. Into the Woods is words and music by Stephen Sondheim and was written and directed by James Lapine. Advanced ticket sales have already topped $3 million, and Broadway theater goers are clearly enchanted by the prospects of seeing fairy tales brought to life on the stage. Previews for Into the Woods begin at the end of the month with the musical scheduled to open on Broadway October 29th, just in time for Halloween. And coming up next, Cagney and Lacey are hauled into court... Now, and showbiz went behind the scenes to two new productions now in rehearsal. The first, Into the Woods, stars Bernadette Peters. And the second, Breaking the Code, features Derek Jacoby. Cynthia Tornquist has more. Bernadette Peters teams with Pulitzer Prize-winning composer Stephen Sondheim and director James Lapine for Broadway's Into the Woods. The musical marks a reunion for this Broadway team who received critical acclaim with Sunday in the Park with George. Peters is currently rehearsing for her latest role. She says the character is nothing like her previous one in Sunday in the Park. In Sunday in the Park with George, I was uh, George Surratt's mistress and a love interest. And here I'm not a love interest. Uh, I'm uh, it's more of a character part and, and a witch, which is fun. Into the Woods is the musical version of the fairy tales of the Grimm brothers. Little Red Riding Hood meets the wolf, and Cinderella meets her prince. Director James Lapine is hoping audiences will be entranced with the show's storybook characters. It tends to be uh, stories that people are familiar with. I mean, most everyone knows of Cinderella, even if they don't remember the story. And it's great to do something in which people bring in a, a sort of uh, frame of reference of their own to the material. Into the Woods makes its Broadway debut October 29th at the Martin Beck Theater. Meanwhile, work is underway for the...